Teresa Judas from RHONJ has married her fiancé Luis Rulas. The pair's love bubble grew by sharing their wedding day with family and friends. Teresa Judas from the Real Housewives of New Jersey found her happily ever after, officially marrying her fiancé Luis Rulas on August 6. The newlyweds had a controversial relationship on the Bravo series when the women questioned Luis' past. Teresa is strong-willed and didn't let her castmates' opinions deter her from tying the knot with Luis. The pair's love bubble continues to grow by sharing their wedding day with family and friends. Teresa met Luis at the Jersey Shore in 2020 and instantly fell in love. They moved in together a year later, and Luis proposed in October 2021 while he and Teresa were vacationing in Greece. The reality stars were excited to tie the knot and spend the rest of their lives together. Teresa was previously married to Joe Judas for 20 years but divorced after Joe was deported to Italy. Now that RHO and G star is looking forward to her second marriage with Louis, Teresa and Louis held their wedding at Park Chateau in East Brunswick, New Jersey. As the Queen of New Jersey, Teresa lived up to her nickname, looking like true royalty. The housewife styled her hair in an exaggerated updo, with long, curly extensions flowing down her back. She also added a crystal tara and diamond earrings to her elegant look. Teresa wore two wedding gowns throughout the night. The first dress Teresa wore was a custom-made Mark Zunino mermaid dress, with sheer gloves embellished with pearls. The designer helped Teresa create a long veil with three hearts and the words, Simper in seam embroidered on the bottom. The saying means always together in Italian, paying homage to Teresa's late parents. Teresa walked down the aisle solo to the song Ave Maria, honoring her parents. Louis' sister, Dr. Veronica Rulis, officiated the ceremony, which had heartfelt moments, such as the couple's children lighting a unity candle. Teresa's four daughters, Gia, Gabriella, Melania, and Adriana Judas stood by her side as the maids of honor, wearing pink satin dresses. Wervio and Gistar's Jennifer Aden and Dolores Catania served as bridesmaids. Ario and housewives Margaret Josephs, Jackie Goldscheider, and newcomers Danielle Cabral and Jen Fessler were also invited to the wedding. For the reception, Teresa, who didn't sign a prenup, changed into a floral, off-the-shoulder gown with a slit down the side. It was the perfect dress for Teresa to enjoy a night of dancing. Louis donned a classic black and white tuxedo as the groom. Teresa and Louis did their first dance as newlyweds to I Get to Love You by Rule with a fog machine on the dance floor. The party was packed with entertainment, and a DJ and a band were playing nonstop hits for all of their 220 guests. Teresa and Louis also hired performers for the event such as a dance troupe that did a routine to Diamonds Are a Girl's Best Friend, and various service acts. Tap Snap even provided a photo booth, capturing memories from the night. Teresa's brother Joe Gorga, sister-in-law Melissa Gorga, and their three children, surprisingly, weren't at the wedding. Her longtime friend Dina Manzo backed out at the last minute and was even supposed to be in the wedding party. Several other Bravo stars witnessed Teresa and Louis nuptials, making it the ultimate crossover event. The Real Housewives of New York City alums Dorinda Medley and Jill Zarin, Kenya Moore, Cynthia Bailey, and Phaedra Parks from The Real Housewives of Atlanta, Chanel Ian from The Real Housewives of Dubai, Ashley Darby from The Real Housewives of Potomac, and Alexia Echeverria from The Real Housewives of Miami were all in attendance. Teresa and Louis' wedding ended with speeches from the couple's friends and family, wishing them the best in their marriage. Melania mentioned how she admires her mom's new relationship and hopes to have a similar one in the future. Gia's emotional message to her mom referenced Teresa's parents and how they are watching over her. Teresa and Louis' loved ones surrounded them with positive energy on their wedding day. Fortunately for Bravo fans, Teresa's wedding was filmed for a special premiering next year after The Real Housewives of New Jersey Season 13.